the Gen 1 Lightning from yesterday. Look at it. Two of the same trucks. Same identical truck, um, but this one's the flare side. Look, you see it? His hand went all like this. Ground beef everywhere, guys. Ground beef everywhere. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Say what's up, man. I can't say it. Say what's up. <laughs> man, and we are back, man. So it is 7.54 in the morning. I'm about to go drop little man off at daycare. And then we're going to start today. We're going to go to Home Depot today to go buy like five or six sheets of wood. Because we I need to start. I want to buy a big zerg. He wants to buy a big zerg, but we'll see. But anyway, so, man, we got to go to Home Depot, man. We got to get a lot of wood today. Then we're going to have to bust a mission to go pick up my boy's truck and then bring it back to the house and then get started on this console. So subscribe, hit that like, man, drop some comments. Let me know where, what's good. And, man, let's get on it. We're probably going to be in traffic for a good solid, like, 30 minutes. Like, trying to finesse our way in, in front of this semi, man. I know I hate to do it, but, dang, we got to get in there we got it so like home depot is like right after this uh traffic light man we made it wait so we're gonna go to home depot man we're gonna get like man a quite a bit sheets of wood and then i'm gonna get some like bendy like real thin wood because we're gonna you know curve uh some things and we're gonna try some new stuff out uh and i'll pick up the camera once i start loading wood back up in the truck so you guys can see everything that i bought i'll catch you guys in five four three two all right, gang, so there's five sheets that are cut. Man, your boy couldn't do it no more, man. My back is killing me, man. MDF is some very heavy wood. And I went, once I got to the fifth um, sheet, man, my back was like, I have a sharp pain right now. I'm not even gonna lie to you, but we got the wood. And, you know, no one bothered to help, but man, like I say, um, man, only you can do what you can do for yourself. So it is what it is. So we got the five uh, sheets of wood in here. We got bendable wood. Man, that's gonna be good for our console. But one thing I'm gonna say is, man, these Chevy trucks do not play. You got all the weight from the wood we just got, plus my box, and this thing has not even dropped one bit. That thing is, is holding up. Chevy stock suspension, man, that thing is not playing. Like, that thing is not even flinching. These are definitely work trucks, man. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This is the definition of a work truck. Like, and my back is killing me. I'm not even gonna lie to you, gang. Uh, and like I said, um, we didn't even have no one help us, man. We just did it on our own. And I always live by the motto, motto, you know, you do what you can for yourself. So I just went ahead and got the, the wood and picked it up from the section, put it in my car, went and got it cut, and that was it, man. We'll come back Saturday and get some more wood, man. But your boy Later tapped things. out. I may actually buy a little small mini van, you know, a little toy mini van just to come pick up, you know, supplies, man. So we'll see what happens, man. But for right now, let's get back to the crib and get back to work. Okay, gang, look, we just got here to pick up the blue lightning, but look, check it out. So this is my, my homeboy's other Ford Lightning, the Gen 2, and we're going to do some work to this one. This one's actually, no, this is a whole different one, um, because the one that we actually did the system in that was black, it's actually this same color, and, you know, this is the Gen 1 Lightning from yesterday. Look at it. This is actually the Gen 1 Lightning from yesterday. And look, this is the flare side. You see what I'm saying? Two of the same trucks. Same identical truck, um, but this one's the flare side. Look, you see it? The bed's actually painted. Same truck. It's gonna get the same, like, he's changing, these are 22, so we're gonna, he's gonna put 24s on it, put the same 24s, and then the same drop. And this one right here, we're actually going to put a, um, we're gonna do eventually do a subs behind the back, teddy panel console and everything. But you know, for right now, these are the beauties that we got going on.
we have our laminate we have our bendy ply that we're going to use for um, a curve that we're going to do on the console but right now what i'm actually going to do is i'm going to get my drill and i actually got to take out the factory center console out of it so that we can be able to work all right so we actually have bolts that are like right there and we can't get them through the actual cup hole uh openings so we got our angle with our quick connect that we're going to attach to our drill so it's going to have like a hard angle then it's going to come and then it's going to like curve and then it's going to curve back over here towards the back gang so so far this is our piece that we got cut out um, we got our angle good and then once it actually sits into place then we can actually figure out this angle because we may actually just cock a little bit more so it looks more of a, like a Lamborghini style dash but we do have to like notch it on the back side up against the back firewall the hump that's on the floorboard and then where those brackets are at. Boy's actually gonna go take a quick lunch break with my wife. Man, stay watching the video, man. Let's go get something to eat real quick. So we just got here to Chili's. We're about to get some food. It's hot, but the boy's hungry. So your boy got some wings, man. Garlic Parmesan, some uh, curly fries. Uh, what's that? A Philly cheesesteak? All right, that's good. You know, I gotta eat my wings with right? ketchup. We're gonna try some of that too. You see it, look, I just found it a quick little drink and then we're gonna get back to work after this. Alright, so I am back from lunch, man. Your boy is full, but man, we still gotta continue working. So this is an end result right here of the first side piece cut out. I'm going to go put it in the truck so you guys can see what is going on. All right, so there you go. Nice cut out right there. So basically it's going to have like iPad, EQ, and a switchboard. That's going to look pretty nice right there. And then the cup holders are going to come right here. I like a levitating armrest. And then we're going to do like speakers stacked up. Okay, so now the next task that we are actually going to tackle real quick is we're going to build this router table. So we're not going to build a big one. We're just going to build something simple that we can use, you know what I'm saying? Not all the pieces are huge, but at least we can be able to maneuver on it. So last time when I made a router table, I made it out of MDF, and then I used that same laminate that I just showed you guys. And I used to just keep it outside, and... I feel like with the moisture after a while, it just ate up the wood and softened it up. We're gonna cut it to shape, and um, then we're gonna drill a hole for, uh, or cut a hole out for the router tip to come through. And then we're gonna draw the holes and drill through it so we can bolt the router upwards and put legs on it, um, put supports on it, and I think it should be done. All right, gang, you ready for a game changer for us here on the Mousetrap Gang uh, Man platform? Man, check this out. I present to you guys our router table. Man, let me get this guy out the way. Look. So the blade is just sitting in there. We can adjust it. We can go up and down with it. But, man, look. Oh, man. 
imagine your little hand going through there? Oh my god, guys, that would be horrible. <laughs> I had a friend one time when I always just disconnect these things, man, because so I have a friend um, making rings, and then you know, it just like got them, like it cut the wood, and then like his hand literally like went. Let me make sure it's unplugged. Yeah, his hand went all like this ground beef everywhere guys ground beef everywhere i drove dude to the hospital guys there was me all in my front seat hey i'm not even gonna lie to you from the hospital to where the shop's at probably like a good like solid five minutes you know what i'm saying it's just one straight road but man we were jamming you know i always had the the, the gucci man playing jamming beaten with the 612s and my blazer at that time man just hauling ass you know trying to beat every single red light everything Dude was leaking, he ended up getting stitches. He was out of commission for like months, man, months. And that's why I was never a big, you know, uh, fan of the router. But um, nowadays we definitely do need it. Um, we're gonna try to be as much as responsible as we can with it. We're gonna take our time. We're never gonna be rushed using this guys because the last thing is I want is any accidents, man. So um, I've seen people eat it, man. I've seen two or three people eat it. I'm not even gonna lie to you. That's why I don't, yeah, that's why I don't mess with this stuff. But, uh, I mean, it's a, it's a game changer for us. And, I mean, it looks pretty. You know, I like it. Um, we can put more stands on it. I did do the holes. Um, and then we have to add um, legs to it to, like, separate to make it solid. But, I mean, it's a pretty solid table. Uh, I'm actually going to always station it up against the wall. So, it's, like, braces itself. And, I mean, most of the pieces that we got to uh, router sometimes are not that big. But we can manage that's the purpose of the router like you can maneuver that thing everywhere and make sure you know what i'm saying so man like this is you see it guys we built it look the router's down there big boy router in that thing it's a plunger so you can adjust the height of it so man i'm actually pretty happy guys i ain't even gonna lie to you man so we actually got so we now that we got this we're gonna definitely upgrade our table saw next um chop saw we're gonna get the one that like pulls out like retracts um, and man, we're slowly getting there probably get all battery operated tools and everything But man, we're, we're coming up gang. We're definitely coming up man So this is actually uh, if you guys saw the video this is like it's glued down and then it's 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 bolted down with the screws But I'm actually gonna let the glue set for overnight We got ahead today man, you know This was a big boy thing that we had to get done the router table and get the cutout for the truck And you know, we can go forward with stuff. I already labeled stuff where it's going here. I'll show you Basically, I already got everything labeled where it's going. So obviously we got mids going right there. Um, the iPad, I am going to look online today. I think they do sell um, one that's already pre-made. So we can just like mold it inside there. It'll look perfect. It's made for what it is. It's an iPad. Um, then we're actually going to move that EQ into right there. We're going to do a badass mount for that. Then we do have a switchboard, a 12 volt. That's going to look really nice and illuminate blue. It's going to look really bad, badass. But then we got some cup holders that we're going to make look like they're floating. Uh, we're gonna make like an armrest in the center and then we are gonna go ahead and do um, a titty panel type of gimmick right here with speakers stacked and then tweeters along the top and this is gonna have like the chasing lights you know right there going up and down so it's gonna like chase on both sides on the top and then just lights glowing on the mids but man listen when I say we are gonna do awesome routed out pieces for this man that was the purpose of the table man because I can't wait. I'm actually excited. If I'm if I fuck up a finger, oh well. That that it is what it is. I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna care as long as the work looks good. But then I'll be held up from working on stuff. But you know we're gonna try to be as safe as possible. Um, so with that being said, man, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Man, we got actually a lot of stuff done today. I'm not even kidding you guys. Um, man, we my back is still killing me. My back is like really like oh my god. Like I don't even want to get into a gang. But enough of that. Hope you guys have a good rest of the day. I'm gonna try to upload. I did a late upload yesterday. That was, was horrible. Um, but we still got a video up. And we are dropping a video here at like seven o'clock, man. So stay tuned, uh, subscribe, and always pay attention around like seven, six o'clock. That's when I'll be dropping videos, man. But your boy, your boy is going through it right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and sign off and I'll catch you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.